Hi guys. Did you know that? <laughs> Do you know that when I accelerate this hard and when I slam on the brakes, right, my floor mats would actually slip in under my brake pads. Okay, no, joking, joking, all right. Uh, so I just picked up a set of floor mats that I ordered online because I saw Uncle YS's video, I saw Tai Chui's video, and if I'm not wrong, I saw Naz's video as well. Uh, basically, it's like this. You know, most of us, when we got our cars, right, we have our factory floor mats. Now, of course, if you have a, a, an M5 competition and your floor mat has competition there, it's of course costlier to replace than if you have a 220i per se, right? Anyway, most of us would want to try our best to preserve our original floor mat and that's why we purchase another set of stuff on top. Now, most car dealers, last time, they're very kind. They will give you a set of, you know, the, the curly hair type, you know, yeah, it's 3M, right? Uh, those are multi-purpose, you know, it comes in a whole roll. They can cut into any shapes and they give it to you, you know, to say that, oh, to protect your ori original floor mats and all that. And it sort of became the, the industry standard for, for a while. But needless to say, these, while they do their work, you know, trapping all the dirt, first of all, they're not the best looking. Secondly, uh, they wear out rather fast. You have a patch there, you, you see mine later. And um, yeah, then there is the uh, the older type, you know, the square boxes one, the PVC type. Actually, to me, those are worse because they are slippery. When you have water on your, on your soles, they are slippery. And when they sort of wear out, that whole thing, as you're driving, you're moving your feet around, that whole thing just really, really goes under your brake pedals or your accelerator pedals, which is not good, not good. And given that this is an Audi, <laughs> we know, we know that in the 1990s, uh, you know, US have that hmm, Audi unintended acceleration thingy. Anyway, so those are the few types out there. But recently, with new technology, um, there are those where they use um, thermoplastic Vulcan something. Basically, it's thermoplastic rubber and uh, it's better quality and uh, does a lot of other stuff that from, my, from me watching their video, I'm convinced. I was like, hmm, I'll give it a try, you know. And of course, there's the burn test. You know, rubber and fire, pyrite, they, they react, right? So let's have a look and see how good it is. And I'm going to show you guys in a while because my parking at home is very dark. So I decided to come here, which hopefully will be my future home and uh, do it upstairs. All right, I'm at KLGCC and uh, turning it. Let's continue later. It's here. And I like the name, okay? It's called Enzo. 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 Waterproof. Of course, you need to be waterproof. You can't be absorbing water, right? Odorless. No smell. I, so if my if my foot smells, if my feet smells, it will be odorless. I don't know. Trap all this. Uh, that's that's what car mats are supposed to do. Anti-slip, and it says dual anti-slip. Maybe above and below both sides are anti-slip that's also what a car mat should do even though a lot of car mats aren't doing it quick dry I... how do you be waterproof which means if i pour water on it water will be there and it's also quick dry I, uh, this one this one this one we need to have a look okay and it's non-toxic okay don't don't <gasps> eat your floor mats all okay. right let's open it Ah, I have my bobbins, nuts for carbon ceramic. 
Oh, how much they cost? Um, for this car, for the RS6, uh, it should be about 370 ringgit. But if you spec it along with the mat for the boot, it will be about 600 ringgit. They mail directly to you because they say it's durable. So, so you'd be wondering why would people want to buy these, you know, instead of using your original format. The original format, first of all, is expensive. And uh, this is an Audi. Imagine if it's a Ferrari, right? These guys, they have the sizes for practically all cars. It's basically custom fit. You can even choose the color. See that? This is for the rear seats, the center part. Nice little logo there. Enzo, if you are watching this, can you do like an Evo Club version? Guys, would you would you would you buy an Evo Club version? Right. All right. So this material, TPV, uh, looks nice. Traps dirt, and is very durable. Uh, we heard a lot of comments out there from fans. There's a famous brand that is not durable. So this claims to be very very durable. So far, it feels like it. You know when it says vulcanized, our rubber. Our tires are rub vulcanized. This is how it feels. Strong rubber. Okay? And this part, the skirts, it can be in black, it can be in red. I know, you know, the immediate thinking is, oh Bobby, why don't you want red? You know, match your color, you know. Come on, it's floor mats. Oh, this is huge. This is for the boot. So let me show you. The industry standard. Now these are this is usually what happens. You can say they are durable, but this happens. And when this happens, this is really slippery. Now the thing is this, you see the two holes here? That's where the dilemma happens. Actually, I mean for me what I observe now. Because that was supposed to clip onto this, the original Aldi's uh, clips. So that would mean I need to take away my original floor mats, store it away, which is, the, which is actually the correct way, you know, because this clips onto it. So I need to store that away to protect that and use this. So replacing that with this, all right? And if I want to protect these Enzo mats, I can then put back my 3M on top. Okay, don't do it. <laughs> Throw these away. Let's pop this out. Easy operation. And yep. These are the original Audi floor mats. They are of course dirty and uh, it's carpet. So when it's carpet, water will sit in and when water sit in you get mold smell you get damped you get all kinds of stuff coca-cola right all the dirts sand it's not easy to clean these right okay let's put this in so it goes all the way up further up than the original mats and then this fits here nicely and let me push my seats to the back so uh, what I like is that covers more than the original ones fit right here and it fits perfectly okay see C-class owners that's a footrest and let's proceed with the others okay it fits perfectly and even this side throw these away and I'm just gonna put this on top of my original LD floor mats there the cutting is perfect and because of the non-slip material the little dots below so you see of course it will it will move less if I clip this in 
but I'm just thinking that for those of you who just want something on top to protect your original mats, this does the job just as well. And it goes all the way up. And because it's custom fit, it fits nicer and more snug than those 3M PVC type. So, if they say that, it's non flammable. Alright, okay, let me just say one thing, not everything, yeah. there's no such thing as 100% uh, unflammable, but given that it's rubber, this type of extended burning, if it can, re if it can extend, withstand it for even like 8 or 9 seconds before you pu pull it off, put it off, it's good enough, okay? So far, I don't see any burning or melting and all that. It's pretty resilient, okay? This is a, uh, I mean, it's something that I could have expected, right? I mean, I don't know, it's a floor mat. It's supposed to do this, right? It's supposed to be able to capture all this. But of course, if you compare to your stock standard one, I mean, Obviously, it's not gonna catch it as well as that, right? I don't want to dirty up this place. Ooh. Clean this up, okay? Okay, water. Okay, it's actually holding a lot of water. So it's one point five liter here. <laughs> Then use up all the but you get what I mean right if you spill something in the back of your car it's gonna hold a lot before it goes out into your carpet all right so yeah uh, spec your car from Enzo's website I'll put the links below and all that one more thing hey look at me one offer any Audi RS6 owner Right? So I want you guys to share this video and uh, once we reach a certain number, help us share and like it and comment. Why don't I send this set to you if you drive an RS6 Avant C7 just like mine. I'll give it to you. Alright? Cheers! Yeah, it's... It was wet before, huh? So... Uh, at least I can prove to you the one that you received works. Okay? I'll send this set to you. Don't mind, right? Cheers.